Hey guys, what is up? Commando here. Welcome to Telltale's um, Game of Thrones. Almost forgot the name of it. Uh, and this is episode four. I believe it's called The Winter is Coming. Sons of Winter, sorry. Close, close enough. Uh, and I just looked up the end of episode three because I can't quite remember what happened. Do the dead frighten you? Well, when they look like that, yes. I just looked up the ending because I couldn't really remember what happened. We met some lady that I didn't know the name of, and I guess nobody else knew the name of either because uh, I didn't get any comments about it. But uh, and we also, uh, spoiler alert: if you didn't, if you didn't see it, either go and watch it or go and play it. Um, God had killed uh, Brit, I think his name was, which was pretty sweet. Um, but this chick, I found out her name is Daenerys Targaryen. Because um, I watched a little bit of Game of Thrones, you know, the ending, the last few episodes of season four. Um, but I'll speak about that in the credits. I'll speak more about that in the credits because there's some weird shiz that I want to talk about um, from Game of Thrones. Um, but I think that's about it. I, and I am going to continue doing the Telltale stuff because this is the stuff I love. And I heard this is one of the most, a this is the ac most action-packed episode. Uh, according to IGN, they said it's the, the best episode yet, so I'm really looking forward to it because uh, the action is what I love so let's hold hands and let's go on this action packed adventure together okay there's nothing wrong with holding hands people it's it's a it's a friendly gesture come on let's do it let's do it come on it's all good and we'll get a little recap of of what happened anyway but yeah still uh, I, I still like to just to have a look to see what happened at the very end And of course, long ass loading screens. And uh, I think Borderlands episode three will be coming out soon, so uh, that's that's good. They're also they're also working on Minecraft story mode, and I think they're just work to, working on way too many projects. That's my thing. They need to hire more people. Telltale, because they're working on so many different things, like like this Borderlands, Minecraft. Wolf Among Us, The Walking Dead, you know, it's it's too, it's too much, you know. I need to. Previously on Game of Thrones. <gasps> that was Tyrion. My father is planning to make a move against your family. He knows all your weaknesses, all your plans, because you have a traitor in your council. Oh yes. He's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. We were told we'd be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. That's enough, Andros. North Grove? That's just some shit story for little kids. I've heard stories. Oh, face. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Forest knew what he was talking about. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. My true name is Sarah. Flowers. You're a bastard? I hope I didn't make a mistake in trusting you. You bastard. And if it isn't Elena Glenmore. Ah, oh, I hate this You're guy. Not still marrying into this wretched family. I hate that guy. I will tell guy. my father our betrothal stands. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. Marine? Shit. What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. If like you Beshka. presume to speak of my dragons, you best choose your words carefully. Gonna be a good little forester, learn your lesson, and stay down. You think I am? Who do you think you are, Corey Graves? Good Lord Roderick, so long as we all know who holds the reins here. The foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Take oh, the boy was... as your ward. Kill him if they give you any trouble. That was episode one, and that's Ramsay Snow. I never did tell you about your father, did I? We bled him at first, like a pig. 
Oh, that was this fight from the last episode. This is good. How is he still alive after that? I don't know. See you, bye, bitch. <laughs> And that fat had seen it all and shot himself. Like, we're probably gonna get in trouble for that, but I mean, it would have been me or him, you know? <laughs> oh, is that, is that him? Looks a lot like the kid that died in the first episode. But uh, it's not. I knew you were a killer the day you arrived. Seems Brit found out too. Fucker deserved it. They all see it. What sort of brother you really are. It wasn't my fault. He attacked me, and... and we fought, and... And you threw him clear off the wall. You told me what you did to get here. We both know you had blood on your hands. But now, you've killed one of your brothers. He you lose him. your head for this, Tuttle. You'll be disgraced, dishonored, and burned till there's nothing left of you. You won't execute me. With Mance Raider coming, the Night's Watch needs all the men it can get. Honest men. Loyal men. Not brother killers. There's only one thing to be done with you now. Hey, Frostfinger! What's that, Frosto? I saw what Garrett did to Brit last night. I was there. My relief was late, so I stayed behind. I saw everything. Go on, then. Finn was only there at the very end. You had your say. Actually, I was there the whole time. Oh. Then tell us. Come on, you Garrett's bastard. Garrett's telling the truth. Brit attacked him. Just like he said, Garrett had no choice but to fight back. There isn't a man at the wall wouldn't sell his own mother for the right price. Hmm. You two are up to something. Some deal you worked out. Or he's defending you for... for some reason I can't fathom. That's impossible. Finn can't stand me. Because you're a fucking squire who thinks you're better than everyone. Enough! Gary, <laughs> kill the man of the watch. There's a price to be paid for that. Let's go! Uh -oh. I knew it was a mistake to make you a ranger. Rossfinger! What's to be done with him? We're heading to Crusted. You'll have to find someone else for your expedition. Your man here still has a lot to answer for. Now out of the way, Snow. Give us a moment. And then kiss him quick and be done with it. Garrett. Let's move. You told me you wouldn't get into it with Brit. What happened? I thought you were smarter than that, Garrett. I thought you were going to be by my side at Crusters. But there's no coming back from this. This isn't right. Brit's the murderer. Frostfinger has this all wrong. What Brit did to your family, anyone would want him dead. But John, is there nothing to be done? Aside from removing Tuttle's head from his shoulders? <laughs> no. But you're about to go off and execute a nest full of traitors at Crusters. How is this? Any different. God's be with you, Garrett. We're down a man, so keep your eyes open. Now let's move. Let's move. Go begging to your gods all you want, boy. It's the axe has the final say. This is unnecessary, bro. He would have done the same thing. If it was him, he'd have done the same thing. And we got an achievement already.
Pretty good whistling, huh? Sons of Winter. Thanks for the art, Joe. Thanks for the environment, Patrick. Thanks for the animation, Eric. Thanks for the choreography, Sean. Mm. Is this this marine place? Oh, this is where Do we were. Do you work. know how many men have stood before me with false tales of my dragons? There's Daenerys. Desperate men, hoping for wealth, protection. Liars, every one of them. And I expect you are no different. You don't want to see what I do to liars. Especially those who seek to waste my time. I wouldn't lie to you. You have my word. Your word means nothing. Not when it is so easily bought. Oh, oh. Oh, shit. Are you frightened? It's a fucking dragon. What do you think? Dragon before. Your reaction says otherwise. Viseron, it's all right. One run in was enough for me, thanks. Clearly. Would you like to touch him? Go ahead. Oh God. Unless you are afraid. Of course, a man who has really faced a dragon before may have reason to be afraid. Go on. Not a good idea, sir. I'm inclined to agree with her on this one. He won't fight. Can I approach him? What's up, Rosephine? Viserion. Oh. Ah! You're brave, at least. <laughs> I don't think he likes me. You still have a hand, don't you? <laughs> you claim you saw Drogon. Give me a reason to believe you. <laughs> I told you I've heard this story before. I'm going to need more than that. You're asking for proof. Will that be a problem? My friend has the burns to prove it. It's likely to leave a scar. Your dragon did this, Your Grace. Well, he wouldn't. You must have tried to fight him. What have you done to him? If you've hurt him... Hurt him? He, he attacked us. Drogon wouldn't strike without reason. You must have scared him. He is not some kind of thoughtless beast. He's only a child. Oh, a child who can breathe fire on whoever he likes. He wouldn't harm anyone. Not unless he was attacked. The men who were following us, the Lost Legion, they drew their swords and tried to fight him. And Drogon defended himself. So we somehow deserve to be burnt alive because your little baby was scared. Your tongue is dangerously sharp, sellsword. Why did you come here? You offer me nothing but lies. To what end? You want gold? title my undying gratitude what do you want from me Asher Forrester I don't want your money I just need your help help very often means money my no. family is depending on me I have to find an, an army. army if you could spare some of your cell swords please if I also came here looking for an army but what I found were the cries of children and people suffering in chains while their masters profited from their misery. My cell swords will help me free the slaves of Marine. That is their mission. Your need is not greater than theirs. These are people who have suffered for years without end. What if we left after the liberation, once the slaves are free? Once the slaves are free, I will sail back to Westeros and reclaim my crown. There is no after. There must be something I can do to convince you. 
As we speak, my men prepare to enter Marine. What they are about to do is much bigger than you or I. Bigger than one family back in Westeros. So, unless you think you can storm Marine and free all the slaves yourself, you have nothing more to offer me. Croft? You may leave. <laughs> That's but it. Your Grace. See them out. Beska knows the city better than anyone, Your Grace. What the hell, Lasher? Is this true? <sighs> yes. I lived in Marine for a time. On the eastern side of the city. Fucking bastard. So you wish to accompany them? You'd help the Second Sons? Guide them into Marine? I can't, Asha. This could be our only chance. Is that what you're saying? You're really considering this? They could prove valuable. Asha, please. We'll help you free the city. If you'll just consider what I've asked. We can talk about that after the slaves have been released from their chains. I believe that's more than fair. You two will join Croft and his men. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. But your uncle stays here. If I find you've lied or put my men in danger, I understand. Good. Croft will get you settled in. It's going to be a long night. Hmm. See ya, Uncle. I told you I didn't want to go back to Marie. What the hell was that? What's your problem, bruh? What's the problem with you and Marine, anyway? It doesn't matter now, does it? Beska, you... Get your armor patch up in here. Extra bed rolls if you need them. Piss buckets in the corner where it's always fucking been. Well, aren't you a pleasant one? Long time since we had a piss bucket. I spent two years trying to get where I am now. Don't fuck this up for me, Asher. Nail! We got two more! Oh, that's that guy. The Joker, Joker guy from the last one. None so wise. Ah, we're here. Oh, damn. Curse this bloody leg. It's not your leg that's a problem, Roderick. You've got to be practical. You want to take Griff down next time? You want to stop lying in the mud and letting people walk all over you? You're speaking to your lord, Sir Roylan. He can fight his own battles. You know why he had to stay down. Even so, it set a precedent. Look at me, Roylan. I can barely hold this damn thing, much less swing it. So, you're gonna give up then? No. There are other ways to fight, my lord. You can't handle a sword like you used to. So find another advantage. Surprise your opponent. Do something unexpected. Like what? I'll show you. Come at me. A little dodger ruski. Ooh. Bring your opponent down to your level. When I attack you, drop down, avoid my blade, and swing at the back of my knees. Wait for me to attack. Okay. Oh, damn. Roderick. Let's try it again. 
Almost. Fuck. Again. There we go. Ha! Now that's how you do it. <laughs> I think you let me. Oh. Check her face. <laughs> 